use the three coins that you got from inside Rambi's little cage to purchase DK's second, um, oh, his first move. Since the first move is basically for all the Kongs. With Baboon Blast, we can play the Barrel Blast courses in the level. Uh, just look for the DK pads. Okay, one of the huts that we pounded uh, had a DK uh, switch along with bananas, so pound the switch. And when we do, a golden banana appears in between banana port 1 and 2. Let's warp to 4. And then it's just a swim across the lake. And we got our third golden banana for DK in this level. Almost done with DK, folks. Okay. Uh, this is a Crusher. Uh, and it has yellow hair. Since yellow is DK's color, let's destroy it. He will leave a blueprint for you to collect. Um... At the very top of the level, you may have noticed uh, some weasel shop or something. Uh, that's where you want to take the blueprints. I'm not going to take them there right now. But I'm going to do this really fast because we can get another golden banana this way if I don't fall off the tree. Coin, 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 and a DK pad. Press Z. And you can't do this until you learn Baboon Bat Blast from Cranky, so make sure you learn that first. If you've played any Donkey Kong game, this should be quite familiar to you. I already have 75 bananas, so I'm not going to worry about getting every single banana. Get that for your fourth banana of uh, Jungle Japes. And with that, we have all of DK's bananas. Or, uh, as for the blueprints, I'm not going to do those until late in the game. So I don't have to use so much film on them. So if you really want to see uh, me turn the blueprints in, tell me and I'll do it, but otherwise I'm just going to wait till the very end to turn them all in. Okay, uh, now we're using Diddy Kong, who has some things he could be doing. He has some uh, red coins in the water. And we'll need those red coins for later, so we might as well collect them now. He also has some banana bunches in the water, so be sure to collect those as well. Diddy actually has some bananas on the trees. And if you haven't guessed yet, uh, Diddy Kong's color is red. And as you can see here, we have a red-haired Crusha, which signifies Diddy Kong's blueprint piece. You can also tell what color a Crusha is based on their um, ground pound or their hand smack attack, the shockwave attack. 
Okay, we're gonna go up here now. Since we have enough coins, we're going to go see Cranky about learning a new move. A move that's just for Diddy Kong. And we'll get that in a minute. Okay, this is called uh, Chimpy Charge. Uh, with this move, you can perform a little charge attack that can push in switches and uh, anything that looks like that can be charged. <clears throat> Before I do the next banana, I want to make, make sure that I got all the bananas out here. There doesn't seem to be any bananas around here, so I'll pound the Diddy switch. <clears throat> By the way, you have to move fast on this. Uh, they don't give you any time limit for Donkey Kong, but for Diddy Kong and the other Kongs, they give you a time limit. Uh, it's not that hard to get there, though. We're just trying to get the Funkies. And as we know, Funkies is just right around here. Banana number one for Diddy. Now let's go inside Funky's armory. Because now we can afford a new weapon. Diddy Kong's famed peanut pop guns. So you're doing right now, Diddy Dude. Okay, so now we have two new weapons. And what can we do next? Okay, I don't know what we're gonna do. Whoa. Don't do that. Don't do that to me, Diddy. Okay, now I'll take the banana barrel can barrel cannon up and get some coins along the way. And we have some bananas. <clears throat> and look, we have a peanut switch. I recommend before doing this, you get Chimpy Charge, because otherwise, you're going to waste a lot of time going back and forth. Make sure there's nothing up here. Nope, nothing. So just go in there when you're ready. Uh, we're gonna get two golden bananas in this room. Let's see, we got some red bananas here. This is what I have to do. Okay, apparently I have to go over here to do this. I wonder if I can get across there. If the camera would cooperate. And it does. And I fall because I'm an idiot. I hate that whistle. It's going to get really annoying.
Let's try this again. Okay, what am I doing? It was better this way. D I fell off again. Damn it. Those beavers aren't really helping either. Okay, this isn't... There we go. And when we pound the switch, uh, ban banana appears at the very top of the tower.